All right, this young lady here has um, SVT, and uh, she's actually had multiple recurrent episodes of the SVT. I'm going to go right up on the screen here, and yeah, see that heart rate, 170. And we're going to flip back over here, I'm going to look at her EKG, and uh, you see that, so 161 on that one, so uh, going pretty fast. So, yes, first of all, you're okay being on YouTube, being being on a video and all that? It's like, okay, good. Yes. You've had multiple episodes of this, and um, usually you respond to the adenosine. Mm -hmm. And one dose, two doses? One dose. One dose, okay. I want you today to tell us a little bit as you're getting your medications, when, you know, when we start to do your medications, how it feels, what you're experiencing, so that other people who experience the same thing will understand what's going on. Okay. You cool with that? Mm -hmm. Okay, good, good. Have you ever had a cardiologist evaluate you? It's been a while. Okay. Have, have you ever had any um, diagnostic studies of your heart other than EKGs? No. No. And you were on a beta blocker, mm -hmm. metoprolol, mm -hmm. at one time, and then that got discontinued. Yes. When was the last episode that you had of the SVT, this fast heart rate? About two months ago. Two months ago, mm -hmm. okay. And you went home without any different and med different medications. No, same, just the same medication. What's that? Just the same medication. Same medications, okay. What medications are you on? I'm on levothyroxine. Okay, so cat. so you you've had your thyroid removed, but mm -hmm. we're gonna check a thyroid level on you. Just make sure you're not too high on your thyroid. Okay. And what else are you on? Calcium. Calcium. Mm-hmm. And that's it. Mm-hmm. Okay, you're not on any medications to prevent you from having fast heart beats. No. no. Okay. All right, good enough. All right, we'll stop right now on this and then we'll once the action starts, we'll we'll start it back up. Okay. So Chris, can you tell us what you're doing? Mm -hmm. So I'm putting together a little stopcock here. Cuz with adenosine, you have to give it rapid push. So one side here is the adenosine, 6 milligrams. The other side here is saline. So we give the adenosine, flip the switch, flush it with saline right after. Very good. Got it. And we're running the EKG. Let's go. Ready? And she's going to tell us what she's feeling too. She's going to capture the whole experience here. Okay. Here we go. One, two, three. Now, what are you feeling? Nothing at what, what is it? Some feeling goes in all my chest. Do so you have chest tightness? No. Are we getting P waves, guys? Yeah. Is the flood are better? All right, so what, were, what exactly did you feel? And when you push it through, I could just feel like it's just going through my body. The medicine's going through my body, up here in my heart. Yeah. And. And so was that like a burning, a cramping, a pressure, an aching, stabbing, jabbing, night? No, it's it's not like a burning feel, but it's just, I guess, not like really if you like tasting the medicine, but I could taste it like in my mouth. You could taste it? Mm-hmm. Was it painful? No, it's not painful it at just, all. It just felt funny in your chest? Mm-hmm. Just feel, it's a funny feeling. And then when the medicine gets through there, everything just calms you down. And, I'll be all right after that. All right, so it looks like your heart rate now is back is down to like 113 up here on the monitor. We got P waves. Here's a new EKG on you. And um, looks like you see P waves. waves, so we got, all right. Well, that was easy. You made this look really easy, so. Mm -hmm. All right.
Okay. Yeah. Made it easy on us. Uh, so we'll check your thyroid levels since you have a history of type of thyroid. Make sure your levels are all okay. okay. And hopefully we'll be able to get you out of here. Okay. Right. Okay. And we'll arrange for So we're going to talk to cardiology before she leaves? 